All right, let's talk about the top five snowiest Novembers in Jamestown history dating all the way back to 1895. That is when uh, the weather records started being kept here. And uh, this is something we talked about yesterday, but it's worth uh, mentioning here. The snowiest November ever was back in 1933, where we had 54 inches of snow. Now, back in 2018, we had 32.6 inches of snow. That ranks as the fifth snowiest November on record, and all of that was mainly lake effect. And last year, we had 7.9 inches of snow throughout the month of November. Now we already gauged our first inch so far this year, so we'll see how much more snow we pick up. And is there any more snow in the forecast? Well, not in the short term. Look at this big warm up across much of the uh, East Coast here. This is warmer than average temperatures as that warm air surges in from the south. That's really going to spike temperatures and you're going to see here how warm we're going here. We project warm air wind. Everybody's going to get warm air. We're going to be in the lower 60s both today, tomorrow, and Friday. But look at Saturday and Sunday. We spike these temperatures up upper 60s on Saturday, and we're making a run at 70 come Sunday. And we could be close to breaking records both Sunday and Monday of next week. This is something we're going to continue to fine tune, but it's definitely going to get much warmer around here. But the warm air means no precipitation. This is the five day uh, precip outlook from NOAA, and it's basically showing you a goose egg across much of the uh, Great Lakes region, including western New York. There is no rain forecast over the next five days, and really over the next seven, we only have one day of rain forecast, and it's only a small chance. So get out and enjoy this wonderful weather this week. Everybody gets sun today. It's going to be milder than it was yesterday. A great day to enjoy the outdoors, but it still remains breezy. 57 on the highest hills. 64 at the Lake Erie shoreline with a south wind, 10 to 20 miles per hour, some wind gusts near 30 miles per hour at times through the afternoon. Tonight, mainly clear and starlit, not as chilly as it was last night, but the winds still remain an issue throughout the overnight. 43 in the valleys, 52 at the Lake Erie shoreline with that south wind, 10 to 20 miles per hour continuing. Now, the next seven days of your life brought to you by 42 degrees and sunny, 61 tomorrow, and uh, we've got another 61 degree day coming up on Friday, and the sunshine will continue both of those days, Saturday, 67, lots of sun. On Sunday, the record high is 73. We're going 70. On Monday, the record high is 71. And if we hit our forecast high of 73, that'll break that record. And only on Tuesday do we bring in a small chance for at least a scattered or isolated shower with temperatures in the mid-60s. We'll take a break. Be right back.